Hello guys, my name is Dr. Shubham. Today's video is gonna be about Volpex 5 Pro Gold Electronic Apex Locator. If I want to describe Apex Locators in simple terms, I would say it is an electronic device that uses electrical circuit through the patient's root canal and oral tissues to determine working length. Let's see what all do we have in the package. This is the main unit, measuring wire, file clip, touch probe, tester, lip hook and the instruction manual. The instruction manual provided has all the details including specification, installation process, maintenance, troubleshooting etc. Volpex 5 is 5th generation Apex locator with LCD screen display, stand to adjust visual angle, power button, just press it lightly and we are good to go, measuring wire socket, socket for adapter, volume indicator and this arrow is to set reference point. Firstly, we will check whether the Apex locator is working properly or not by connecting this tester. If the numbers displayed on the screen are 0 0.2, 0 0.3 and 0.4, it means we are good to go. Let's see. As you can see, it is showing 0 0.3. It means we can go ahead. Touch the volume button to select different volume settings and the arrow to set reference point. Check if the circuit is complete by connecting the lip hook to the file clip. The sound tells us that the circuit has been formed. Attach the file clip to the metal shaft of the file. We will see how Volpex 5 works on this acrylic simulator. We'll introduce file slowly in the canal using watch winding motion and you can see progression of the file in the screen as the file reaches the position of the pical foramen the reading is displayed as zero strips are green in the apical area and as we go beyond apex it becomes red with a faster beep Apex Locators acts as an adjunct to radiographs, but as radiographs provides only two-dimensional view of three-dimensional objects, so it can be sometimes misleading. So it is indeed wise to incorporate Volpex 5 in your practice. It can be used to determine whether perforation in the canal communicates with the periodontal tissues. And not to forget, it might interfere with the cardiac pacemakers, so should be avoided in such patients. That's all we have for you today. See you next time. Until then, like, share and subscribe to our channel for more updates.